Haoyan Heavy Equipment Technology Company, Limited in Xijing, focused its research and development in the first half of the year on electromagnetic ejection equipment, while its manufacturing focus was on drones. In addition to the Zanshin, one attack drone, another tailless sci-fi surveillance and attack drone designed by Jiang Chong has also been developed. It is called the Phantom A-1 and has a flight time of up to two days. Not only that, Jiang Qing also optimized the intelligent control system for the drone swarm for Yi Hao Yan, which allows engineers to achieve a higher level of control through skill learning when operating. Of course, this aspect has also made Jiang Qing and Yi Hao Yan's company become the leader in the field of domestic military drones. After the army purchased it, it was full of praise for the Zanshan. 1 adding 500 units in the first half of the year. It can be said that it is the second profitable project for the company besides changing hands to operate military-resistive chips. A Zanshin, one drone costs 8.6 million yuan. This batch is worth 4.3 billion yuan. Immediately afterwards, Jiang Cheng arranged for personnel from the newly established Maple Fire Aerospace Company under the Maple Fire Group Company to come to Haoyan Heavy Equipment Company for docking. At the same time, Third-party personnel were invited to find a suitable base on the islands of Nanhai Province and build an electromagnetic catapult launch base. Of course, this all takes time. Jiang Cheng did not continue to waste time here, but went to Jincheng to continue completing the final biological neuron test. Unlike by Zaiguan protein, biochip neurons are much more complex and cannot transport neurons directly into the brain directly through the blood. Instead, Proteins carrying carbon nanotubes are needed to help transport them into the cerebral cortex neuron area. While supplying energy to the brain neurons, they can also fuse the carbon nanotubes with some neurons. This in turn allows some brain neurons to possess certain super memory abilities. By the time Jiang Cheng arrived at Fengji Technology Company, Professor Zhang Lan and his team had already completed experiments on mice. Through observation, the protein carrying the carbon nanotubes injected into the blood of the mice was successfully transported through the blood to the cortex of the mouse's head. Some carbon nanotubes have fused with brain neurons. After a period of time, there were no adverse reactions. It seems that the biochip neurons we developed will not cause harm to living things. Zhang Lan said with a smile, the transport protein equipped with the carbon-based chip will not disappear easily due to programming reasons. Only in the brain decarbon nanotubes are released only in neuron-like areas. I feel like a competent transportation captain, several people said jokingly. Jiang Qing nodded. This is the function of neuromorphic function. Just like the Bayes guardian protein, it can realize information interaction with other cells. These carrying proteins can tell other cells what they are used for during the blood circulation in the body, so they are generally not occupied by other biological tissues. Zhang Lan then said with emotion, This is the first time I have discovered that chip technology can be so closely connected to biology. While others are still studying the functions of those cells and proteins, we are already studying the use of cells and even neurons in the body through chips. Zhang Chang raised the corner of his mouth. This can be considered a cross-border scientific discovery together. By the way, next, shall we conduct experiments according to biomedical standards? or conduct human experiments according to CHIP scientific research standards. Logically speaking, this thing, related to the human body or memory, requires great caution. But Zhang Lan was a little anxious and really wanted to see the results of this new technology product. So I asked about this. Zhang Chang had an idea. After all, his stuff was very new and cutting edge, and there were no relevant laws that explicitly required it. This is not considered a drug. It is not used to treat illnesses. In this case, let's find some volunteers first and conduct a controlled experiment. Jiang Chang made the decision, I will communicate with the senior management about the specific situation. Academician Jiang, can I be the first one? Suddenly, a young man on the side stretched out his hand. Jiang Cheng's memory was super strong, so he naturally knew that this was Luo Ming from Shanghai Jiaodong University. He is only 29 years old and has already graduated with a doctorate. After being recruited into Jiang Cheng's biotechnology division of Maple Fire Group, he soon became the main force in research and he took the lead in many neuron fusion experiments. The level is also very good, and he has a persistent pursuit of biological science and biotechnology. Luo Ming, according to experiments, this thing has no side effects, 
but do you really plan to be the first to volunteer? Zhang Cheng said. Luo Ming nodded excitedly and said loudly, Yes, academician Zhang, I believe you. Okay, another big fan. Zhang Cheng nodded, Okay, Shaolin, go and get the agreement. Let's start the first experiment today. Assistant Shaolin behind him immediately responded and turned around to get the agreement. Zhang Lan glanced at Luo Ming and admired his courage. Do you need to discuss this with your family? No, I can make the decision myself. Luo Ming shook his head. Academician Jiang, can this thing only be injected through blood? Jiang Cheng waved his hand. No, you can drink it directly. After the protein is absorbed, it can enter the blood and continue to travel towards the neuron area of the brain. That would be better. Luo Ming's eyes lit up. In this way, this protein can be turned into a nutrient solution and promoted as a health product. After all, it's a bit strange to ask people to take four drips to achieve strong memory abilities. Drinking health supplements is different. After drinking it, memory improves, which is a healthcare function. And the approval of health products is much simpler. At this time, Zhang Cheng also had concerns in his mind. Rather than making people think that it improves memory through surgery or transplantation, it is better to think of it as a healthcare function, which is more acceptable to everyone. Yes, and I want to remind you that this improvement is temporary memory, and it requires multiple trainings to achieve memory improvement. To form a solid long-term memory, scientific memory methods must be assisted. Zhang Cheng then said, Zhang Cheng has simulated the function of the entire biochip neuron many times in his body. The effect is natural and obvious, but it is not as high as Jiang Cheng himself. Jiang Cheng thought that it was impossible, except for himself, to have a god-level memory all of a sudden. But with this help, it was completely possible to bring about a more powerful memory. In this way, people who often use their brains can train the brain's biochip neurons to become more powerful, but if they are lazy people, even if they have it, they will not be able to achieve god-level memory. This is more in line with current needs. When Xiao Lin brought the agreement, Luo Ming glanced at it casually and signed it directly, Academician Jiang, let me be the first to experience it. If successful, Luo Ming will be the first person in history to have a powerful memory ability that has been modified. It might even make it into the history books. Looking at the courageous Luo Ming, Jiang Qing nodded in approval, then asked Zhang Lan to bring a test tube of white protein-carrying liquid and handed it to Luo Ming. Luo Ming glanced at the test tube, removed the cap, and drank it directly. The other scientific researchers were speechless and stared at Luo Ming carefully, wanting to see what his reaction would be. But obviously, this thing doesn't react all at once. Zhang Lan said, Luo Ming, you will be the subject of our research this month. We will use 24-hour observation and testing to see how effective it is. No problem, come on. Hey, mom, why did you call suddenly? Jincheng Fengji Technology Company closed its scientific research base. Luo Ming was kept in the laboratory around the clock and was followed by specialized scientific researchers. He didn't have to worry about food and accommodation. He had nothing to worry about, but there was a strange problem. That is his excrement. You cannot poop it casually. Special personnel must collect it and conduct testing. In addition, they must be tested by various instruments every day. He had not contacted his family for a month, but now he received a call from his mother. Ming, didn't you go to work for the Maple Fire Group? Why haven't we contacted you recently? We thought you had joined a pyramid scheme. A worried but relieved voice came from the loudspeaker. Luo Ming was still drawing blood from his right hand and replied, Mom, didn't I tell you? I'm busy with research recently. I will call back when I have time. What kind of research? I haven't heard back from you for 10 days and a half. Um, being studied. The company's research needs to be kept confidential. Luo Ming said speechlessly. Okay, you haven't responded to messages for more than a month. Your dad is worried about you and just knows that you are okay. He needs to come back early during the Chinese New Year. Your second aunt has introduced you to someone. No more, I'm going to do some research. Luo Ming hung up the phone directly. When I heard about this blind date, I felt dizzy. The girl drawing blood next to her couldn't help but laugh. Brother Luo, you are so good. Why are you being forced to go on a blind date? Yes, yes. Luo Ming nodded. He is a man majoring in science. He has always been studying and doing experiments. 
When he was in college, he still had acne on his face. It is better now, but he still has a lot of acne marks on his face. He is not handsome and looks ordinary. Coupled with his low emotional intelligence, it is indeed difficult to find a girlfriend. As for this girl, she came from the military medical university. Her name is Zhang Nan. She has short hair and a slightly baby fat face. She smiled and said at this moment, Brother Luo is very demanding? No, I, it's just about right. He he, I heard that the vaguer the conditions, the higher the requirements. Zhang Nan said, well, okay. I took it for testing. It should be good. Good. Watching the girl leave, Luo Ming's heart moved. Alas, finding a girlfriend is not that easy. Luo Ming, how are you feeling today? Just as he was daydreaming, Jiang Cheng, Zhang Lan, and his entourage came over again. It has been two days since he took the protein, and Jiang Cheng and others will come twice a day to understand the situation and randomly test his memory. Luo Ming stood up and said, Academician Zhang and Professor Zhang are all fine. Today I feel my mind is clearer. Well, let's continue testing. Zhang Cheng said. Immediately, the staff at the side took a thick ancient book, Ziji Tongjian. Page 67. Look at it for a minute. Okay. Luo Ming turned to the page number and began to read and write down. On this day, he felt that his memory had improved a lot. After reading the sentence, he immediately recalled it in his mind and remembered everything clearly. The minute is over quickly. The staff held the watch and took it away as soon as the time came. Luo Ming closed his eyes slightly and began to recall memories. In just a moment, he started reciting. Meet in Mianqi. The king and the king of Zhao were drinking. The king of Qin asked the king of Zhao to play the harp, and the king of Zhao played the harp. There are so many beauties, but they will forget their wives and I would like to pursue them. Zhang Lan was very surprised when he listened. He looked at this page and listened to Luo Ming reciting word for word. Correct. After Luo Ming finished memorizing, his face showed joy. Academician Jiang. I feel that after watching this, my mind is very clear. Even the symbols inside are very clear. It feels like I took a photo and stored it in my mind. Zhang Lan opened his mouth wide. Oh my god. This is incredible. Jiang Cheng smiled slightly. Continue to page 125. Continue to page 162. It took half an hour for Jiang Cheng to ask Luo Ming to randomly memorize four pages of paper. After each memorization, Luo Ming was able to recite the entire text. Jiang Cheng then said, Page 67. You continue to memorize it. Hey, I'm back to the place where I recited it for the first time. Luo Ming was stunned for a moment, trying hard to recall the previous memories. Meet in Mianqi. This time, my memory was a little incomplete. Although I roughly memorized it, I made a few mistakes, and it was far from as smooth as the first time. Luo Ming's originally excited expression turned into frowning and thinking hard. It seems that I want to get back the memory state that was so powerful at the beginning. The memory replayed over and over again in my mind. I feel that there are a few places that I didn't remember clearly, and even now I'm still not accurate enough. Luo Ming was a little depressed. Jiang Cheng was not in a hurry. Okay, you can continue to rest. We will come back later. Zhang Lan took the book and followed Jiang Qing out of the laboratory. Director Jiang, the memory effect seems to be very obvious. There seems to be problems with long-term memory. Well, what we are currently changing is mainly D-type shorter memory neurons. So Luo Ming is still very fast in shorter memory, but without multiple memory trainings, these memories cannot form long-term memories, and there will still be memory loss. So, do we have a solution? You can try the solution, but I guess it still requires multiple trainings to form a solid memory. Jiang Cheng thought for a while and said, The first way is to integrate C-type neurons with carbon nanotubes, but this method is not very good. Because the number of this type of neurons is relatively far less than that of D-type neurons, and the current research is not in-depth enough, there is no guarantee that problems will not occur. Therefore, Zhang Cheng's solution is to improve the carbon nanotube program carried, and at the same time optimize the information carried by the protein to increase the probability of D-type neurons mutating to a certain extent. In other words, through repeated memory training, 
some of the biochip neurons can be solidified and become long-term memories. Of course, this is the first-generation product designed by Jiang Cheng. In the future, he will also use the multidimensional neural network model formed by biochip neurons to record information in carbon nanotubes and interact with neurons through neuromimicry. This method can permanently preserve the information recorded in the carbon nanotubes, which is similar to the god-level memory that Jiang Cheng currently has in his body. But this is just Jiang Cheng's future direction to promote technological development and is not a problem that needs to be solved urgently. And this technology cannot be solved in a short while. Jiang Cheng was able to achieve a significant improvement in memory through this method, which is already a huge technological improvement. Therefore, in Jiang Cheng's view, his generation of technology can only be said to assist memory, rather than realizing biochips to assist memory. But Zhang Lan didn't think so. In his eyes, this technology was already super awesome. It can be said to be an epic-making product. Even an extremely strong short-term memory is beyond the reach of ordinary people. At night, Zhang Cheng and Zhang Lan came to test Luo Ming's memory results. Sure enough, at this time, except for page 67, which he memorized repeatedly and achieved a relatively accurate recitation, he could only memorize a few sentences on the other four pages. Jiang Cheng and Jiang Xinwan. Unlike the experiment on white mice, this time it was actually conducted in the human body. Only then did Jiang Cheng realize that the method he had adopted was still not perfect. With the help of biochip neurons, people can achieve relatively powerful short-term memory, but this memory is not sustainable and will be lost quickly after a little time. Jiang Cheng could see this feeling from Luo Ming's face. It was a sense of loss. It's like having Alzheimer's disease. I know I remember this moment, but I don't know when I will forget it next. Therefore, after he learned about the experimental situation, he immediately entered into the rhythm of scientific research. There is not much of a problem with subsequent modifications. The first is to reduce the ability of short-term memory, and the second is to improve the ability to form medium and long-term memories through multiple memories. Now, looking at these issues from the perspective of Jiang Cheng's research technology, we need to adjust the adjustment parameters, weaken the intensity of stimulating D-type neurons through carbon nanotubes, and increase the value of stimulating medium and long-term memory neurons. Soon, in just one night, Jiang Cheng simulated again through the computer in his body and obtained more scientific parameters. He then improved the equipment parameters and produced more realistic fusion carbon nanotubes. The entire preparation process has many key nodes and difficulties that cannot be solved by one or two people. Jiang Qing also believes that under these powerful confidentiality measures, the technology of this biochip neuron cannot be leaked. A few days later, through selection and recruitment, 40 volunteers were found, the youngest was 18 years old, and the oldest was 71 years old. The 71-year-old volunteer has some Alzheimer's disease. Jiang Cheng also wanted to take this opportunity to see whether the biochip neurons have different effects on this type of patients. Alzheimer's disease is generally thought to be caused by amyloid deposition and neurofibrillary tangles in the brain, which prevents the neurons used for memory from forming effective memories and makes it very easy to lose information. Jiang Cheng didn't know much about this area. He just wanted to take this opportunity to do experiments. Naturally, the experiments were not done in the laboratory but were specially delivered to their homes and administered to them. Because it was random, half of the people didn't take the real medicine, just a placebo. However, the effect is obvious. On the third day after taking the medicine, the volunteers all said that their memory abilities had improved significantly. Especially the 18-year-old female high school student Ling Su, who suddenly showed strong memory potential in school. As long as she memorized an article twice, she was able to memorize the entire text. After training the memory three times every hour, it became a long-term memory. In the staff's test, her memory of this article was still clear one month later, with only a few exceptions. She needed to think carefully before she could restore her correct and complete memory. Jiang Cheng attached great importance to this experiment and went to see it. This Ling Su girl has an average appearance, is a little fat, comes from an average family background, and her academic performance is in the middle of the class. By chance, she saw the selection of volunteers and went to participate with the mentality of giving it a try. Because when Jiang Chong and the others were recruiting volunteers, they didn't talk about anything else, 
that is, brand new biotechnology health products that can improve memory. When she was in school, her memory was always bad and she couldn't even remember the formulas well. So although she read and practiced hard every day, her grades could not improve. She didn't know how many times she cried. But after she accepted the volunteer experiment with uneasiness, she felt that her head was much clearer the next day. It's that feeling of thinking about information, processing information, and memorizing information very quickly. Things that seem to need to be memorized are remembered immediately, and as soon as they are recalled when needed, they appear immediately. The whole person feels very relaxed. The historical events, specific times and people that were originally boring to watch but could never be remembered became extremely relaxed in her memory. Among the staff who contacted her about the experiment, there was also a very handsome uncle with a very nice voice who also taught her how to carry out memory training. Under this memory training method, she felt that she really wanted to become a super brain character that can only be seen on TV. So lucky. She is not stupid. She knows that if this health product is really launched on the market, the price is probably not affordable for her family. However, because of this risky move, she became a volunteer and became the first group to be greatly improved. People with memory skills. Ling Su, did you bring a cheat sheet? How could you get such a high score this time? Just as she was sighing, a fat man next to her pointed at her and said directly with malicious intent. Ling Su was furious, little fatty Wong. What did you say? Wang Xiaopeng curled his lips. Humph, the teacher asked you to go to the office and tell the truth. I advise you to be careful what you say. If you can't do it yourself, don't doubt others. Ling Su said forcefully, then stood up and walked away. Get out of the way. Wang Xiaopeng snorted coldly. We'll see how you behave later. Ling Su looked bad and quickly arrived at the teacher's office, where he saw his head teacher and history and politics teachers staring directly at him. Ahem, Ling Su, you're here? The head teacher coughed lightly and said, Teacher, what do you want from me? That's right. Your scores have improved significantly in this midterm exam. We would like to ask about the situation. The head teacher did not express his doubts directly, but said tactfully. Ling Su didn't get angry, but said truthfully, I have been drinking healthcare products to improve memory recently, and I feel that my memory has improved a lot. The head teacher glanced at the two teachers next to him. The two shook their heads slightly, but with smiles on their faces. Well, in this midterm exam, your total score reached more than 580 points. You have made great progress. You will continue to maintain it in the future. The head teacher encouraged. We have also heard reports from some students in the class, but they are all without evidence. You the best response is to do better next time. I will. Ling Su clenched his fist slightly and left. She felt that her destiny might have been rewritten because of this adventure. After school in the afternoon, as usual, the staff of Fangji Company picked her up and dropped her off and checked her various physical conditions and tested her memory. Uncle Jiang, thank you. I feel that my memory has improved very quickly, especially after following your memory training method. I feel that I can remember things for a long time. In the business car, Ling Su happily thanked Jiang Cheng. Jiang Cheng felt weird being called uncle at first, but considering that he had given birth to a child, it was normal for him to be called uncle by these high school students. That's good. It's just that I don't know if this improved memory is short-lived or will last forever. Ling Su was a little worried. If it was only a few months away, it might be difficult for her to afford it in the future. Jiang Cheng Dao, so we need to do experiments to see how long it can last. In the next few years, our company will follow up and understand. And we need your cooperation. Yes, I will definitely cooperate with everything. Ling Su nodded heavily. The results of our final exam came out today, and I ranked ninth in the class. Jiang Cheng smiled slightly and praised her. In a daze, he remembered that when he first came to this world, every improvement in the exam gave him endless confidence. Only those who have experienced the senior year of high school will know this kind of joy. Time soon came to November 2019. Since August 12th, Zhang Chang has no memory of the development of the entire world. However, although he cannot clearly understand major events, at least Zhang Chang can predict the development trend. There are no big problems with biochip neurons anymore. We just need to continue to carry out experiments. Based on the communication between Zhang Chang and the top management, 
it is expected that a limited number of products will be launched starting in the first half of 2020. Jiang Cheng naturally has to make money. After all, researching and manufacturing this kind of thing requires a high level of technology, and R&D costs, material costs, and labor costs are all big problems. After many calculations by Jiang Cheng, the price was initially set at 19,999 yuan per bottle. From the perspective of technical design and biology, Jiang Cheng's technology cannot guarantee that the enhanced memory will become permanent. After all, his technology only uses carbon nanotubes for assistance, and the neurons of the brain are biological tissues after all, and there are certain damage problems. Preliminary estimates suggest that the effect of improving memory will slow down after one to two years. Another bottle will be needed by then. Not only that, Jiang Cheng discovered through experiments that this biochip neuron can also enhance the stimulation of neurons and alleviate the condition of a 71-year-old elderly man with Alzheimer's disease. The current plan is to select 100 first-year high school students across the country every year in the form of incentives and give them free use. In addition, it is planned to supply less than 1 million bottles per year. In terms of value, it is nearly 20 billion, and there is demand almost every year. This is a major benefit that benefits both the country and the people. Of course, Jiang Qing also believes that as production capacity increases and technology advances, prices will fall and supply will increase. At the same time, Jiang Chang and other staff also found that if the experimenter does not perform multiple memory strengthening trainings as required, it will be difficult to completely form a long-term solidified memory. So compared to ordinary people, their instant memory is just stronger. After arranging things in Jincheng, Jiang Chang took a plane and headed for Pingcheng. Yu Xinran is approaching her due date. In terms of time, November 11th to 17th, 2019, is the expected delivery week. No matter how busy he was, Jiang Chang had to rush back. However, what he didn't know was that a huge change was taking place. Ahim, you kid. You've been busy in Jincheng for so long, and you came back twice on the way. As soon as he returned home, Chen Ru put her hands on her hips and scolded. Jiang Chang now held Yu Xinran's arm and replied with a smile. The research these days has reached a critical stage. There is nothing we can do. Yu Xinran knew what Jiang Cheng was busy with and said, Mom, don't blame him. What he is studying now is very important. I know too. Chen Ru rolled her eyes at Jiang Cheng. My in-laws will be arriving soon, so I'll go to the hospital to stay in the afternoon. Different from the last time. This time Jiang Cheng's family all lived in Pengcheng, so even if they were hospitalized, the arrangements were the best. Yu Xiuamin and Jiang Yi knew that their daughter was about to give birth, so they immediately took annual leave. The timing was also a coincidence. Jiang Chengcheng had just arrived home, and soon after, Yu Xiuamin called and told Yu Xinran that he had arrived at the place where Weixi Navigation was located. Grandma is here. I'm going to pick up Grandpa and Grandma too. Jiang Xinwan said beside her, holding Jiang Cheng's sleeve. As soon as Jiang Cheng came back, Jiang Xinwan ran over. However, Jiang Cheng didn't come back much this year, which made her not very attached to him. Although Jiang Xinwan is over three years old at this time, she looks like a five-year-old child. She is sensible and sensible. More importantly, Jiang Xinwan at this time has already met the Xinhua Dictionary. All characters are already studying primary school curriculum. The tutors I hired had to change their teaching plans and teach several times faster than ordinary people. Yu Xinran was at home because she was pregnant, so while she was studying, he taught her the principles of life and doing things. Therefore, at such a young age, she already knows a lot of things. Although Jiang Cheng has not been back for long, she also knows that this is her father, and he is very powerful. She still wanted Jiang Cheng to teach her mathematics and computer knowledge. Okay, Wan Wan, let's go pick up Grandpa and Grandma. Jiang Cheng smiled, picked him up, and walked out. Zhang Xiaoyong saw this and followed closely. When he arrived at the door of the villa, Zhang Cheng saw the driver who went to pick up the plane and sent Yu Xuamin and two of them there. Mom and Dad. Grandpa. Grandma. Zhang Xinwan was even more happy. She immediately jumped off Jiang Cheng's hand and ran to Jiang Yi. Jiang Yi now had a smile on her face and hugged Xinwan. Wan Wan, you have grown taller again. Hmm. I'm over 1.1 meters tall now. Jiang Xinwan said proudly. 
Yu Shuamin and Jiang Qing nodded, and then went to tease Jiang Xin Wan. Wan Wan, Grandpa also gives me a hug. Wait a minute, I still have to talk to Grandma. Okay. Yu Shuamin laughed. The driver now opened the trunk and took out two large boxes. Zhang Xiaoyong went over to help carry it. Several people walked into the villa. Why is it difficult to carry so many things along the way? Zhang Cheng said. Your mother said she was afraid that the temperature would drop in a few days, so she brought her down jackets. Yu Shuamin said with a smile. I said the temperature in Pengcheng won't be that high. Yes, the winter here is quite warm. Yu Xinran saw the two of them at the door. Dad. Mom. Hey. Zhang Yi said hurriedly. Although he occasionally video chats, they are not in the same city after all, and Zhang Yi misses her very much at the moment. Is your due date in the next few days? Then he took a serious look at Yu Xinran's big belly and said, It looks like it's a boy. Boys and girls are fine. Jiang Cheng replied with a smile. Yes, yes, that's fine. Jiang Yi nodded. Chen Ru and Jiang Yiping also greeted them warmly and then arranged a room for them to stay here. After dinner in the afternoon, the group took two cars and headed to Pingqing Maternity and Children's Hospital. I spent money and made a reservation in advance, and I was able to get in very quickly. After inspection, production is expected to take a few more days. VIP Special Ward, the room is quite large. There are accompanying beds next to it, and it is also equipped with dedicated nurses and doctors 24 hours a day. After all, it wasn't that fast. Zhang Yiping and Yu Xuamin took Jiang Xinwan back home first, leaving Jiang Cheng and their parents behind. After all, it was not the first time to give birth to a child, so Yu Xinran was not nervous at all. At this moment, he and Jiang Cheng were chatting together. Jiang Cheng shared with her the current research and advancement status. Then you plan to enter the aerospace industry? Yes, our Earth's resources are limited, but outer space is not. Take the solar system as an example. With so many planets and satellites, the sun also has almost infinite energy for humans. Zhang Cheng said. Yu Xinran chuckled. Well, you are already thinking about developing into the outer world. Ha, huh, but it's not that fast. It has to be done step by step. I plan to build a space scientific research base and an intelligent space materials factory in the next five years. Jiang Cheng said, This is just the advancement of the plan, that is, the direction. It cannot be achieved all at once, but as long as you have a goal and achieve small goals step by step, you can reach your destination. What about the biochip neurons? Didn't you say last time that the state had a partial stake? Yes, 40% shares, 80 billion. Jiang Cheng nodded. After the success of the experiment, China's State-Owned Assets Supervision and Administration Commission has taken a stake and paid 50 billion yuan, and it will take next year to settle the investment. Zhang Cheng plans to use this 50 billion to build an aviation launch base. It is conceivable that in the near future, our country will have many academic masters with outstanding memories. Yu Xinran suddenly smiled and said, I wonder how they compare with us? It can't compare to us. Jiang Cheng shook his head. To achieve a permanent super memory like ours, the technology one am currently researching cannot achieve it, but as technology changes, it may one day be achieved. If the biochip neurons that Jiang Chang is currently studying are version 1.0, then these mutated biological cells in his body realize the powerful functions of memory and calculation, plus the god level function of simulating all things, then they are version 999.0. Jiang Chang still needs to continue to study and improve his technical level before he can delve into the secrets. Yu Xinran said leisurely, I wonder if this little baby in my belly will also have your magical abilities? There will be. Jiang Cheng gently stroked Yu Xinran's belly. Through bioelectricity, he can sense the little life inside. Inside, there were also mutated biological cells similar to those in Jiang Cheng's body. Yu Xinran smiled slightly, that's good. Our children will be very good in the future, just like his father. Mom is also excellent. Jiang Cheng smiled and gently scraped her nose. Yu Xinran is also very capable, but because of Jiang Cheng, she did not fully demonstrate it. Instead, she helped manage the company while Jiang Cheng was concentrating on research and development. Today's Maple Fire Group has so many subsidiaries and huge amounts of various funds, all of which require her assistance in management. Chun Ru was talking to her in-laws nearby without disturbing them. 
By the morning of November 11th, doctors and nurses were with me throughout the entire process, and I was ready to enter the delivery room. As a bodyguard, Lin Yun followed him every step of the way. Zhang Cheng felt a little nervous. After sending Yu Xinran into the delivery room, he paced outside the door anxiously. As usual, it was a cesarean section. After 10 o'clock, people sent it out. The nurse came out holding a crying baby. Then there was Yu Xinran lying on the hospital bed. Her face was a little pale, but her face was full of happiness. Mr. Jiang, congratulations. It's a boy. The nurse held the person and glanced at Jiang Cheng. When he got close to Jiang Cheng, Jiang Cheng saw that the child slowly stopped crying, blinked, and looked around curiously. Chen Ru and Jiang Yi were very happy and took it immediately. Jiang Cheng took Tai Xinran's hand and said, It's a boy, like me. Um. The arrival of a new life made both families very happy. After Jiang Xinwan arrived, he was filled with love. He he, little brother. Yu Amin was even more happy. In the ward, she hugged the child and refused to put it down. Jiang Cheng, have you chosen a name? Jiang Cheng and Yu Xinran looked at each other and said with a smile, I had already thought about it before and called him Jiang Shani. Perseverance of perseverance? Right. It's pretty good too. Yu Xuamin said with a smile. Xiaoi, Xiaoi. Chen Ru said, the two of them discussed it and they agreed on this name a long time ago. Having two children brings more joy to the family. But this birth time, the same date as Yu Xinran, is a coincidence. Elegance. Just when Jiang Cheng was still happy, there was a scientific research and experimental base on the other side of the ocean. How is it going? It has spread. Is that okay? No problem. This thing is just like the flu. That's good. China's technology is developing very fast now, and we must find ways to contain them, otherwise, we will never have another chance. But if this thing is released, I'm worried that it will open a Pandora's box and we won't be able to deal with it. It doesn't matter. Time passed quickly. Jiang Chang stayed at home with Yu Xinran for the rest of his confinement and then went to Fanghua Group Company to handle various tasks. The end of the year is approaching and it's time to take stock of various tasks. Jiang Chang looked back on this year and found that he had not done much specifically to promote it, but as a huge company, Maple Fire Group's products all enjoyed a high reputation in the market. Especially starting from 2019, relevant companies will focus their work on foreign markets. It can be said that this is the first year for Maple Fire to face the international market. Lee Sillen reported to him on the assessment matters in the past six months. The group company executives and subsidiary general managers and deputy general managers have been included in the senior leadership assessment. This part is expected to be included in the virtual equity allocation for 289 people. Li Silin handed Jiang Cheng an assessment form, which will be carried out in different categories. In this list, determine the people who share virtual equity. Scientific researchers, 1,690 of them, have made major scientific research achievements within three years of the new year. There are 689 sales design and other personnel who have performed outstandingly in the past three years and have been recognized for their sales performance. Administrative personnel have been evaluated as outstanding for more than two consecutive years in the past three years, and 392 personnel have performed well in the evaluation. Except for the general manager and deputy general manager level personnel of subsidiaries, that is, scientific researchers will be selected at the group headquarters and each wholly owned subsidiary, other sales, administrative, and other personnel are employees of the group headquarters, including two business divisions. Among them, the proportion of scientific research personnel is the largest according to Jiang Cheng's requirements. Of course, these scientific research talents have indeed played a big role in the development and replacement of the company's product technology. Jiang Cheng is more about pioneering technology in a new field, but subsequent hard work, technological changes, and extended development are the tasks of these R&D teams. The number of people is controlled at 3,000, of which scientific researchers account for about 60%. Zhang Cheng said, in addition, are there any people who enjoyed virtual shares before but were not included this time? Zhang Cheng took a brief look and found that he knew all the senior executives here, but some of the scientific researchers, administrative, and sales staff were a little unfamiliar. After all, 
With the size of the company, as chairman and president, it is impossible for him to take care of it in such detail. That's not true. Everyone knows that they will be re-evaluated every three years, and their performance in all tasks is very good, Li Silin said. Jiang Cheng chuckled lightly. This is only the first adjustment. Come and take a look at the next adjustment. I'm sure a lot of work enthusiasm will diminish. Not many people had enjoyed virtual shares before, and they were all the backbone of the company, especially those who were familiar and recognized by Jiang Cheng. But with the rapid expansion of the number of people enjoying it, it is no longer possible for Jiang Cheng to inspect and get familiar with each person one by one. This must rely on the system to operate. Li Silin is someone he trusts, and he needs Li Silin to be serious and responsible for this. After hearing this, Li Silin smiled and stopped talking. Just like the subsistence allowance, it is easy for you to give it to him, but it is difficult to get how much. The same is true for dividends. There have always been dividends, but when it comes time to adjust, they won't be adjusted out so easily. Although company management is more liberal, human relations are like this everywhere in society. By the way, has the director in charge of marketing been selected? There are currently three candidates. The first is Wei Zhiqing. He is a director of the group, but in recent years he has been mainly responsible for Zhiqing Investment Company and rarely assigned group work. The second is Gu Xiaolin, the marketing director of the group company. Her advantage is its business proficiency. Li Silin then looked at Jiang Cheng. As for the third one, the third one, I suggest Yang Zichian. Jiang Cheng looked calm. Why did you choose him? He has a very high emotional intelligence. It is understood that everyone who has come in contact with him recognizes him. Li Silin said, but he is a computer professional and I don't know how he is in marketing. Jiang Cheng thought for a while and said, let Wei Zhiqing be in charge of the market and add Ding Chengjun as director. Okay. Li Silin was a little surprised that this candidate was not on her list because Ding Chengjun was not familiar with the market, so he did not consider it. But compared with Yang Zichian, the Maple Core business unit that Ding Chengjun is currently responsible for is the core of the group's core products, and it is appropriate to be added as a director. We must work hard to train new middle and high-level managers. The list of training courses for next year will be drawn up as soon as possible. I want to personally inspect it, Jiang Chang said later. When it comes to a company, human resources and financial rights are the most important. Because Jiang Chang has a lot of research and development matters, he often entrusts Chun Feng and Li Silin with their daily management, but he also has to play his own role in personnel matters, especially the appointment and dismissal of new middle and high-level cadres. Otherwise, it is easy to be ignored. No matter how much you trust the two of them, over time, employees will become unaware of Jiang Cheng's existence. After staying in the company for a few days, Deng Lian, the temporary head of the newly established Maple Fire Aerospace Company, called him and said that the space launch site had been found. Jiang Li immediately took a plane to Nanhai Province. The chosen location is on the west side of Qionghai City, below Wanchang, at Zhang Mailing. Director Jiang, you see, this location is very good. We have detected that the entire mountain is mainly made of granite, which is very hard. The slope upward from here is about 45 degrees, with not much fluctuation. The hired third-party manager, wearing a white safety helmet, introduced Jiang Cheng. In front of Jiang Cheng's eyes, there is a continuous mountain range, and this point is the head. Viewed from the foot of the mountain, the terrain slopes upward. What's the relative height? It's 830 meters from here to the ridge. Manager Chang said, the length of the slope is about 1,300 meters. Jiang Cheng felt good. Okay, this place is good. It's tilted to the east. We can use the rotation of the earth to save energy. Deng Lian asked from the side, are we really building a runway that goes up the mountain? To be honest, he was confused when he received the task from Jiang Cheng. Suddenly, instead of engaging in aerospace, he found a mountain to build a launch runway. This really surprised him. Yes. Jiang Qing nodded and then asked, I remember you majored in physics and material science. Are you interested in helping me manage this aerospace company? I'm afraid I can't manage it well. I'm a novice in aerospace, Deng Lian said. I am also a novice, so we need to recruit professional people. Jiang Cheng waved his hand. It is not good to directly compete with the National Space Center for people. 
You can find retired aerospace engineers, rehire a group of them with high salaries, and recruit a group from the school. Later, Zhang Chun continued, in the next year, there will be two things. The first is to start the construction of this space launch runway according to my design, and the second is to establish and improve the relevant departments of the aerospace company and recruit corresponding personnel. Talent. Focus on setting up the Aerospace Power Research Institute, the Spacecraft Overall Design Institute, the Aerodynamic Experiment Institute, the Aerospace Mechanical and Electrical Equipment Institute, the Ground Service Center, and the Aerospace Control Center. After agreeing to the location, Jiang Cheng spoke to Deng Lian alone. Deng Lian was under great pressure. Hiss, so many departments? This is still a key department. When we are actually doing it, it is not that simple. Jiang Cheng smiled. I contacted the China Space Center, and they also support us in developing and expanding the private aerospace industry, especially for our I am very interested in the launch concept. Starting tomorrow, you will take people to the China Space Center to learn about aerospace knowledge, especially the overall operation. Okay. Deng Lian responded. The aerospace industry is the focus of Maple Fire Group's next development. 50 billion yuan will be invested in the first phase. If such a large amount of money is invested, at least some results will be seen. Jiang Cheng looked at him and said, Deng Lian's mouth opened wide at this moment. Such a big number showed how much Jiang Cheng valued this company. As Jiang Cheng's most valued candidate, having him take charge here is both a huge opportunity and a huge challenge. Don't worry, Director Jiang. From today on, I, Deng Lian, will be taking root here. Well, but this place is a space launch center. It doesn't mean that all departments are placed here. Contact the local government first to acquire the land. Zhang Cheng then reminded. Deng Lian nodded. I have had preliminary communication with this side before, so the problem shouldn't be big. Well, make arrangements as soon as possible. Zhang Cheng paused, then took out a small bottle of potion with Fangji memory written on it. This is the latest health product launched by the company. It can effectively improve memory. It will be officially sold in China as soon as the new year. After drinking it, you will get twice the result with half the effort in your future work. Is this the product rumored on the internet? Good. Deng Lian also heard about this. That is, Fengji Company has launched a health product that can greatly improve memory and can be called a miracle drug. However, I heard that one bottle costs 19,999 yuan. In other words, the health product in Deng Lian's hands costs 19,999 yuan. Deng Lian was so happy that he immediately opened the bottle cap and drank it without saying a word. The taste is a bit sweet, which is quite delicious. Jiang Cheng smiled after seeing it. Go back and follow the methods mentioned on the official website and improve your training in time. Your memory will be greatly improved by then. Okay, I'll try it when I get home. It will take a day to take effect. Jiang Chang shook his head. The company will first allocate 5 billion and also arrange for Lili to be the financial director. We need to be more careful with this expenditure. After all, it was a big sum of money and Jiang Chang had to have someone supervise it. Lili was recruited from Maple Fire Game Company and her performance has always been conscientious. It's time to let her go out and exercise. I understand. Deng Lian responded. Okay, go recruit troops and take action immediately. Jiang Cheng waved his hand and got into the car. After deciding on a place, the next step is detailed design and construction. However, this huge project will be almost impossible to complete in less than a year. Because in Jiang Cheng's design, it is necessary to eject spacecraft within 200 tons and the entire runway needs to have a higher carrying capacity. In order to achieve load-bearing, it is necessary to bid for the construction of Waziho Enterprises with corresponding qualifications. At that time, the supported bridges will need to have thick reinforced concrete deep into the mountain to form a strong support. If this project is successfully constructed, it can be regarded as a miracle project in China. As for aerospace engines, for now, Jiang Chang can purchase them and then use his own after technical follow-up and technological breakthroughs. If it were to launch aerospace in the form of a rocket, Jiang Chang could purchase a lot of equipment and assemble it himself. But Jiang Cheng's personality is different. Now that he has entered this field, he must achieve certain changes, be different from others. Just like catapult launching a spacecraft, 
Zhang Chang had already made big moves to realize it when some countries were still experimenting. Of course, before his own launch base is built, Zhang Chang still needs some satellites from his own company to prepare for future launches. Today's space resources and good locations have been robbed, especially by the United States. Masa's SpaceX company has launched the Starlink project, which uses a large number of microsatellites to occupy space resources. However, for Zhang Chang, the Earth's space is a transition, and he is interested in the moon. Zhang Chang is also a science fiction fan, otherwise he would not have written a science fiction novel Galaxy Chronicles when he was on the Maple Fire Chinese website. Dyson Sphere is one that he is very interested in. Of course, being interested doesn't mean he thinks this is feasible. Because the sun is so big, even if you collect all the steel in the entire solar system, it will be difficult to put a ring on the sun. What's more, for a long time, the Earth needs the energy brought by sunlight. The current development of human beings is too small. Every second, the energy of sunlight reaching the Earth's surface is equivalent to the energy generated by 5 million tons of coal. This is still the result of being blocked by layers of atmosphere. If Jiang Chang builds a solar power station with a radius of nearly a thousand kilometers in space, it will have great power generation efficiency and can support the construction of a space factory. Once the space factory is successfully constructed, it can be used as a starting point in the future to move towards the vast solar system. The so-called shortage of resources by then may be a joke. Who will occupy the vast unclaimed land first and develop it first? Planting the Chinese flag will also make it clear in the future history of China that Planet XX has been our country's homeland since ancient times. When he thought of this, Jiang Chang couldn't help but raise the corners of his mouth slightly. But this is all a distant reverie, and Jiang Qingdu is not sure when he can see it. What is certain is that with his appearance in this parallel world, the historical process will be accelerated a lot. When leaving for Pengqing, Jiang Chang received the news while still at the airport. An unknown virus appears in Jiangzhou and seems to be highly contagious. After hearing this news, Jiang Chang just smiled and didn't worry too much. Maybe it's a new infectious disease. I believe it can be controlled soon. And now that the Chinese New Year is approaching, Jiang Chang will not make a special trip to Jiangzhou. In Jiangzhou, Shindu Technology Company is just here. By the time Jiang Chang returned to Pengqing, it was already January 6th. Maple Fire Group Company is now intensively preparing for the year-end summary meeting, and Jiang Chung also held a board meeting to discuss the second expansion of virtual restricted shares. Everyone, Li Silin also briefly explained the list just now. The list of relevant personnel is on the conference computer in front of each other. Let's take a look and see what opinions you have. Jiang Chung said, In this share expansion, the share capital of virtual restricted shares has reached 1.86 yuan, but even 33% of virtual restricted shares are arranged to have 30 billion shares. The market value of Maple Fire Group has exceeded 1 trillion. After calculation, the shares held by Chin Feng and others have been diluted, but in fact, the number of shares held is slightly more than before. This is because the company has grown significantly compared to three years ago. According to estimates, in 2019, the total revenue of Guangfengwo Group Corporation was 172 billion yuan, and its own net profit reached an astonishing 51 billion yuan, including foreign markets. Maple Fire Technology Company, Mobile Phones, Computers, has an annual revenue of 650 billion yuan in the Chinese market and about 580 billion yuan in foreign markets. The annual net profit reached 212 billion yuan, and 50 billion yuan of profits were handed over to the group headquarters. Maple Fire Semiconductor Company's annual revenue was 96 billion yuan, with a net profit of 43.5 billion yuan and a profit of 15 billion yuan turned over to the group. The other subsidiaries are generally stable and have no particularly large growth. The cumulative profit turned over to the group is 10.5 billion yuan. Calculating this, Maple Fire Group Corporation had a net profit of 126.5 billion yuan in 2019. This is money that can be used to expand reproduction, reinvest in scientific research, or distribute dividends after removing all types of income taxes, labor wages, material costs, etc. Of course, in accordance with Maple Fire Group's consistent investment in scientific research, investment in this area will continue to increase. 
As for the funds used for dividends, Jiang Chang plans to use 20% for dividends. 20%, that's 25.3 billion. According to the share composition, Jiang Chang holds 67% and can receive 16.9 billion yuan, while the other 3,000 people will receive 8.349 billion yuan, with an average of 2.783 million yuan per person. Of course, this is average. However, it is expected that a minimum dividend of about 1 million yuan can be obtained. Those who can enjoy dividends are required to stay in the company for at least three years, except for senior executives or those who have made great contributions to individual scientific research. Therefore, these 3,000 people account for almost 40% of the staff of Maple Fire Group Company. This benefit is very good, and every employee cherishes it very much. In the list, employees with outstanding performance for more than three years are included, especially scientific researchers who have made contributions, Chun Feng said, I agree with this plan. Agree. Everyone raised their hands to express their approval. The issue was passed quickly. The second topic is to add a new director. Jiang Chang continued, Li Silin's suggestion from the inspection is to by-elect Ding Chengjun as director. Set up two alternate directors, alternate directors Yang Hui and Yang Zichian. Jiang Cheng naturally agreed with this issue, and everyone had no objections. What's more, the carbon-based chips that Ding Changjun is responsible for are currently the group's most profitable products. In other words, strength determines status. The ability to make money also determines status. As for alternate directors, it is also the right thing to do. If there is a vacancy, they will be filled in order. The third issue is that the market has always been under the responsibility of Vice Chairman Chin Feng, which puts a lot of pressure on him especially now that the group's business is expanding rapidly and the domestic and foreign markets are complex. I want Jiqing to be in charge of the market. Wei Jiqing nodded and said nothing. Jiang Chang had already talked to him before that. He has always been Jiang Cheng's deputy in investing. There was some discussion at first about why he could make so much money all at once, but later he learned that he had followed Jiang Cheng in investing in Bitcoin. Jiang Cheng never asked for the profits from Jiqing Investment Company to be turned over, but asked him to continue to expand investment. Later, the family business became even bigger. Chun Feng touched his almost white hair and said with a smile, We need more people to share the pressure. Although he had served as multiple directors before, except for him, Li Silin and Yu Ron, who is currently on maternity leave, the others were all full-time directors and were specifically responsible for their own subsidiaries. As the group company continues to expand, the revenue of the group company alone has reached hundreds of billions, and various daily affairs put him under great pressure. Everyone laughed kindly. In the blink of an eye, seven years have passed. Chun Feng has always been at the forefront of the company and is responsible for daily operations. And from the Maple Fire Game Company with less than 100 million yuan to the current Maple Fire Company cluster with a revenue of over 1 trillion yuan, it is a real achievement of hard work. Today, he is 48 years old. Zhang Chengke is only 26 years old. This is also the reason why he has no half-hearted loyalty to the company. Without Zhang Cheng's trust, he would not be able to manage such a large Maple Fire group. Perhaps, which game company is still trying to open up the market. In addition, a rotating CEO system is set up in the group company's management, with three directors taking turns, each taking a one-year rotation, and one round lasts exactly three years. Zhang Cheng then said, The first batch of rotating CEOs are Zhang Cheng, Chen Feng, and Imo Tianqing. Warwick was the first to implement the rotating CEO system, and then some Chinese companies also tried to learn it. The key to Jiang Cheng's setting up of this system is that as the company's most powerful scientific research core, he is sometimes unable to take care of the company's daily operations. However, he had been serving as CEO concurrently before, but apart from major matters, many of the daily tasks were done by Chun Feng and Li Silin. Therefore, he plans to try this new system. In 2020, when the relevant scientific research projects are basically implemented, he is waiting for the results and applications. He plans to spend time personally managing the company. For the other two years, Chen Feng and Imo Tianqing will be in charge of management. As chairman, he will not worry too much except for the board meetings that need to be attended. See how this works. If the results are good, 
then the second batch can take turns among Li Silin, Wei Zhiqing, or Yu Xinran. As the chairman of the entire company, Jiang Chang still has supreme authority. Chen Feng and others did not expect that Jiang Chang would suddenly implement this system and were stunned for a moment. Director Jiang, just add a few deputy general managers to the management. You should be the general manager. Chen Feng said, Deng Lian just went to the aerospace company again, and our group company only has two deputy general managers. We will discuss the changes in management later. Jiang Cheng waved his hand and said, Li Silin smiled and said, let's listen to Director Jiang. Yes. In addition, it is the development plan of the group company for the next year. Jiang Chang continued, Chen Feng submitted a planning report on behalf of the group company. Everyone should take a look. The entire plan is written in a grand and detailed manner. The development ideas for 2020 are mainly based on the current situation and adding new development directions, such as biochips and technology and aerospace technology. In addition, the development of Douyin was clarified. Through multiple capital increases, share expansions and listings, Jiang Cheng's Maple Fire Group's shareholding ratio reached 45%, and the remaining shares were acquired by Byte and other companies, as well as tradable shares. With the expansion of Maple Fire Group, Jiang Chang focused on Douyin in terms of publicity. At the end of 2019, Jiang Cheng arranged for Jin Bing to go to Douyin to be specifically responsible for technology and operations. And it carries artificial intelligence, Xiao Feng. Jiang Cheng believes that he will be in a favorable position as a propaganda mouthpiece in the future. BI Station also owns shares. Douyin still holds the controlling share. In terms of text promotion, the relationship with Pengfei is handled well, and the Weixin official account is also relatively stable. Only Tsonglong Weibo is slightly weaker. But the current maple fire is so strong that everyone is staying away. In addition, there is also the promotion of the listing of Maple Fire Culture Media Company, Limited, Maple Fire Chinese Network. At present, the development of Maple Fire Chinese Network has reached a bottleneck. Even if Li Zichio is replaced as the general manager, the development results are still not obvious. When the performance of each subsidiary company was compared in 2019, Li Zichio and Maple Fire Culture Media ranked last. Of course, this ranking does not mean that Maple Fire Chinese Network has declined, but that compared with the development trend of other companies in the same period, there is a feeling that if it does not advance, it will retreat. For this reason, Jiang Chang also plans to promote the listing, firstly to obtain development funds, and secondly, he plans to replace the general manager through the appointment system. Director Jiang, I am slow in thinking about this aerospace development plan and I still can't understand it. Mo Tianqing was a little confused and asked directly. Jiang Qing glanced at the others, feeling that they were all the same and confused. Because of the need to develop more sophisticated technology, Jiang Qing paused and said, Maybe you don't understand it very well, but if I tell you, in the weightless and vacuum environment of space, our carbon nanotubes can what about achieving higher precision and higher purity preparation? Director Jiang do you mean to build a semiconductor factory in space? Guo Xiaoming was stunned. The semiconductor factory is just one of them. Hiss. Everyone was surprised. While they were still thinking about continuing to expand foreign markets and obtain greater profits, Zhang Cheng's heart was actually in space. Moreover, once you say it, you do it. He is not like some entrepreneurs who just talk. Of we're relatively low. Now he is suddenly asked to be the general manager of a company that Jiang Cheng focuses on supporting development. The treatment and attention are completely different. I also gave him a bottle of Maple Wisdom Memory. Is this the new memory-improving drug developed by our Fungji company in Jincheng? Everyone's eyes lit up. Although the company has kept its confidentiality very strict after moving to Jincheng, it is now being tested, and many people have heard about this medicine through the internet, moments, etc. Director Jiang, you favor one over the other. Just give it to Deng Lian, and none of us. Li Silin curled her lips and said, I said that this guy Deng Lian called me a few days ago to chat with me and didn't say anything. Oh, I called you too? Jiang Cheng smiled and then explained, On January 20th this year, it will be officially pre-sold. Only 1 million bottles will be sold throughout the year, and the price is 19,999 yuan. It's so expensive. Although Mo Tianqing had a lot of money, it sounded a bit expensive. 
Chin Feng shook his head and said, If I can really improve my memory, not to mention reaching the level of memory as strong as Director Jiang, even half of it, I feel that my work will be relieved a lot. Jiang Chang raised his lips slightly, Okay, we are the parent company, and we will definitely have an extra batch of supplies. Although it is not much, everyone will have it. After the meeting, everyone will have a bottle. Real? Very good. Director Jiang is awesome. Director Jiang, I declare you. Um, it seems like something strange was inserted. Jiang Chang stretched out his hand to signal everyone to be quiet, and just as he was about to talk about the next topic, regarding the adjustment of the management of the group company and related subsidiaries, the phone on the table vibrated twice. After the signal was connected to the computer in his body, Jiang Chang discovered that it was Zhao Yang, the deputy minister of the Ministry of Health of China. Before that, Jiang Chang had contacted him many times when he was researching biotechnology products at Carlin Biotech and Fungi Company. Of course, the other party was also very polite and respectful to Jiang Chang. The emergence of Bayes Guardian protein has allowed most cancers to be cured, which is a great move for the benefit of the people. The biochip neurons were transformed into Fungi memory, which naturally communicated with each other. The experimental effect is very obvious. But considering various factors, the output is controlled to 1 million bottles in 2020. For China, it still hopes to go through long-term testing for one or two years, and then promote it after there are no side effects. As for the 1 million people in the past two years, it is somewhat experimental. When thinking of this, Zhang Chang still took the phone and answered the call. Unexpectedly, the other party's voice was very urgent. Director Jiang, excuse me? Director Jiang. Excuse me. Zhao Yang's voice was a little urgent. I wonder if it's convenient for you now? Minister Zhao, please speak. Jiang Cheng signaled everyone in the venue to be quiet and spoke calmly. There is a problem in Jiangzhou. The minister knows that your company is deeply involved in biotechnology research and would like to ask you to bring your team to study together. Virus? Jiang Cheng frowned, remembering what happened through the gossip a few days ago. But it makes the Minister of Health of China a little nervous, so the problem is probably a bit big. Jiang Cheng also paid attention through the Xiao Feng in his body. Not long ago, someone posted a suspected SAS post on the internet, but it was quickly deleted. Yes, it's a kind of BD. Minister Zhao, what do you need us to do? Experts are currently studying it, but this BD is extremely complex. I would like to ask your company to use biochips to assist in detection. Okay, I'll arrange for the team experts to come over first. I'll arrive later. Jiang Cheng agreed immediately. Then he hung up the phone and immediately contacted Yang Hui, asking Chen Jiqiang to lead 10 key people to Kyoto first. It is said that the contagion is somewhat strong, so you should take strict protective measures. Clear. Things were arranged, but Jiang Cheng still frowned a little. Before he was reborn, he had no idea what happened next but he vaguely felt that something was not right. If it were a common infectious disease, it would have been controlled early. But now, from when there was some rumors to January 16th, it still hasn't stopped. Vice Minister Zhao Yang even called Jiang Chang personally to help. It stands to reason that China has all kinds of infectious disease experts and all kinds of equipment are very complete. So there is no need to find Jiang Chang. But this time he actually did, which surprised him. The problem may be more serious than you think. Seeing that Jiang Chang was still thinking, Li Silin coughed slightly and interrupted his thoughts. Director Jiang, what's wrong? It's nothing. Let's continue the meeting and speed up the meeting. Jiang Chang waved his hand and moved on to the next topic. This issue requires slightly more personnel. This includes changes in the senior executives of the Maple Fire Group Corporation, as well as the general managers and deputy general managers of some subsidiaries. Related issues moved quickly, and Jiang Cheng almost settled the matter of personnel matters with one word. After adjustments, the senior executives of Maple Fire Group Company, headquarters, are as follows. Jiang Cheng, chairman of the group and rotating CEO, is responsible for all administrative affairs of the group. Chen Feng, vice chairman of the group and rotating CEO, assists Jiang Cheng in the operation of the group. He is mainly responsible for the administration department, Domestic Operations Department, Information Department, Logistics and Procurement Department, and connects with Maple Fire Network Technology Company, Games, 
and Maple Fire Display Technology. Business Department, Maple Fire AR slash VR Technology Company, Maple Fire Property, etc. Lee Sillen, Vice Chairman and Vice President of the Group, Deputy Director of the Equity Incentive Management Committee, Director of Group Organization, mainly responsible for the Human Resources Department, Party and Mass Work Department, and Group Shareholding Committee, and is in contact with Maple Fire Culture Media, Maple Fire Chinese Network, Jiangfeng Fishing and Fire Special Effects Company, Maple Fire Film and Television Media and other companies, Maple Fire Training Base, etc. M.O. Tianqing, Group Director and Rotating CEO, assists Jiang Cheng in group operations. He is also the general manager of Maple Fire Technology Company. He is mainly responsible for the channel department and infrastructure department and liaises with Maple Inn Battery Technology Company, Douyin Company, and Jiangyu Technology Company. Wait, Yu Xin Ron, director and vice president of the group, assists Jiang Chong in supervising the financial affairs of the group and subsidiaries, is responsible for the group's audit department, safety supervision department, and security department, and is in contact with Maple Core Business Department, Maple Fire Aerospace Company, Maple Fire Semiconductor Company, and Cardlin Biotech. Wei Zhiqing, Director and Vice President of the group, is also the General Manager of Zhiqing Investment Company, responsible for the Marketing Department, Planning Department, and Liaison with Duolong Industrial Investment Company, Maple Fire Cloud, and Big Data Companies. Zhou Xiaoqing, Director of the group and Director of the Finance Department, is mainly responsible for the group's finance and the financial guidance of each subsidiary. The main operating executives are all here. Compared with before, Mo Tianqing and Wei Zhiqing have been enriched, and vice president positions have been set up. The situation of contact and docking with subsidiaries has been adjusted accordingly, which has reduced Chen Feng's burden. In addition, several assistants to the president have been added to assist with daily operations. As for the most critical Maple Core business unit, Maple Fire Semiconductor Company and other companies, Yu Ron was asked to contact them, but Jiang Chang was actually in charge of them himself. These companies are the core of the group's development. At least for now, Jiang Chang does not intend to rely on others. Even if Qin Feng and Li Sil and Jiang Qing trust each other very much. I didn't realize it at first, but when I sorted it out, I found that the entire huge group actually had so many departments and subsidiaries. Hundreds of thousands of people ate with Jiang Chang. Jiang Chang was also a little stressed. It is still necessary to accelerate development so that the company can continue to maintain strong market competitiveness and vitality. Only in this way will revenue be better and profits higher. In addition, there are also some minor adjustments to the management of subsidiaries. For example, at Maple Fire Culture Media Company, the general manager has been replaced by general manager Xiao Dong. At that time, Li Silin will announce the appointment and ask to speed up the pace of listing. After the meeting, Jiang Chang retained the rotating CEOs, Chen Feng and Imo Tianqing. I just received a call from Vice Minister of Health Zhao Yang. You may have guessed that there is a situation in Jiangzhou. We don't know what the direction will be at the moment, but we must be vigilant. Jiang Chang looked serious and explained to the two of them. Chen Feng couldn't help being surprised. Is it so serious? The situation is not optimistic, but before there is an official notification, everyone should keep it confidential and don't spread information casually. I have already sent a message to Irving. I just invested in a medical device factory a while ago. I am looking at some masks, disinfectants and other things to prevent infectious diseases. It is necessary to prepare in advance, even if you don't use it, you can donate it. Mo Tianqing just came over to take over as rotating CEO. He just nodded and said nothing. Understood. Chen Feng also responded. Now the management has made a clear division of labor. In the next year, the two of you will have to worry about it together and work hard to make the company bigger and stronger. Jiang Cheng reminded. Moreover, Jiang Cheng is on duty this year, and most of the time he will manage various affairs in the group. Later, Jiang Cheng asked Chun Feng to leave first, leaving Imo Tianqing alone. Director Jiang. Mo Tianqing suddenly felt a little nervous, just like when they first met. Although he had heard some rumors before, when Jiang Chang actually announced it on the board of directors, he was still a little surprised. Although he is a director, he actually has no control over the affairs of the group company headquarters, 
and is dedicated to the management and development of Maple Fire Technology Company. But now he suddenly came to the management of the head office, which made him somewhat uncomfortable. I haven't specifically asked for your opinion before. Do you have confidence in this new position? Yes. Mo Tianqing said loudly, We will follow Director Jiang and have the confidence to create greater glory. Jiang Cheng said amusedly, Okay, let me tell you the truth. Your business management level has improved a lot. Just in Maple Fire Technology Company, it seems to be the world's number one in terms of revenue, but you can't settle for just one corner. Take a broader view. Mo Tianqing listened carefully and knew what Jiang Cheng meant. Of course, if we dig deeper, we actually have the intention of transferring him away and decentralizing power to Qin Feng. But he also understands these things. In the past few years, the sales of mobile phones, computers, tablets, etc. have risen to the first place in the world. The revenue is too high, and he has been there for six years. No amount of trust can replace it. Supervision. It has to flow. Director Jiang, don't worry. I will seriously assist in the relevant work of the head office from now on. Mo Tianqing expressed his position. That's good. Jiang Cheng said with a smile, You should also take care of Maple Fire Technology Company. Didn't you train new people? That Lu Zixuan is not bad. Let her experience it appropriately. Let's see how she and Liao Jingtong are doing together later. Who is better? Whoever is better at that time will take over from him and become the general manager of Maple Fire Technology Company. Mo Tianqing smiled and said, Understood. Although Jiang Cheng didn't know, he heard from Zhang Jiqiang and other researchers who arrived in Kyoto that this BD was very complicated. Jiang Cheng has also taken care of the matters at hand, and has already given employees leave in advance, except for important department personnel, but I always follow up to understand the latest situation. Things are getting more complicated. What do you think? At an expert-level meeting of the Chinese Ministry of Health, the vice president asked, Those present here at the moment were all experts and scholars in the fields of infectious diseases and respiratory diseases, as well as big names in biotechnology research, and Chen Jiqiang was there, sitting in the back row. He was a little nervous. Such a high-level meeting was discussing extremely important matters. They had done research in the field of biochips, but they were somewhat amateurs in this matter. He was thinking, it would be great if Jiang Cheng was here. But at this time, Jiang Cheng is the chairman of a large company after all, and he can't just come here without handling the matter well. Judging from the genetic sequence, it may be derived from YS animals, but there is no reliable evidence that it is derived from Jiang Zhou. We are still trying to isolate the virus strain, and it is expected to take several days. Mr. Third said, I suggest FK Jiang Zhou as soon as possible. One word caused a thousand waves. This is a metropolis with a population of tens of millions FK. Who dares to make this decision? Yeah, I think it's better not to be too arbitrary. Deploy medical personnel to support and see what happens next. The vice president frowned. This suggestion was too big and he couldn't make a decision. Can everyone express their opinions? Soon, every expert went through it. When Chun Jicheng arrived, Zhao Yang on the side explained, This is the biotechnology research team of Maple Fire Group, Professor Chun Jiqiang. Sun Min's eyes lit up. Is this the team led by academician Jiang Cheng? I heard that the Bayes Guardian protein you developed is very effective in treating cancer. Chun Jiqiang nodded and smiled, and then sorted out his words, Currently, we use guard proteins for this virus, but because the BD situation is unknown and there is a lack of corresponding characteristic sequences, we cannot identify it. It would be great if our director Jiang was here. He has very deep research in the field of biotechnology. Sun Min nodded with a solemn expression. Minister Zhao, I think it is necessary to invite academician Jiang to come and provide joint advice. He has won the highest science and technology award twice in a row, and the leaders are full of praise for him. I heard that something has been developed to improve memory. It's really incredible. Zhao Yang naturally responded. I have contacted academician Jiang and will arrive in the next two days. The meeting also reported the latest situation, which is very not optimistic. The vice president immediately went back to report. It is said that the state council will also hold a meeting to study and judge. On the evening of January 19th, Jiang Cheng rushed to Kyoto overnight 
and met with Mr. San and a large number of experts. Three academicians, I have admired my name for a long time. It is a blessing to meet you today. The 80-year-old man in front of him still has firm eyes. The other party looked at the youngest academician in China and nodded slightly, Academician Zhang. I have heard your name many times. You are young and promising. I wonder what the third academician thinks of this BD? After a brief greeting, neither of them had time. So Jiang Cheng asked directly. It is highly contagious and highly toxic. People with Z syndrome have serious lung lesions? Mr. San said. I feel it. This single-stranded RNA virus is very camouflaged. Jiang Cheng also started experiments. Before he arrived, several equipment for Carlin's biochip research had been shipped over, and everyone started researching BD together. BD specimens were taken from Jiangzhou, including virus specimens in humans and virus specimens sampled from locations. Jiang Cheng stretched out his hand, and even the samples and instruments simulated a virtual experiment entering the body. The first thing to do is gene sequencing. With the help of the powerful Hualong one in his body, Zhang Cheng used more than 80% of his internal computing power. The whole person seemed to be sluggish. Hualong One, which is based on carbon-based chips, still does a good job in terms of heat dissipation and power consumption, but for Zhang Cheng Lai, when he really uses a lot of computing power, he will feel that his actions will be a little slow. Fortunately, it was not full of computing power, so he said it was still acceptable. The entire calculation lasted for six hours. It was not until 6 o'clock in the morning that Jiang Chengfang completed the entire sequencing. At the same time, through research, he described the appearance, characteristics, characteristics, etc. of the entire BD strain. At 7 o'clock, Zhao Yang, Mr. San and others came to check. It's amazing. Academician Zhang's research in the biological field is amazing. Even the director of microbiology had to admit Jiang Cheng's awesomeness. Their people are still being sequenced and strains have been isolated. But after Jiang Cheng arrived, it took less than half a day to complete the sequencing and other tasks overnight. This is a new type of BD. At present, it can bind to the human body's angiotensin converting enzyme 2, ACE2, receptor, and there is a large possibility of mutation. Jiang Cheng did not need to use the manuscript, facing the projection explained to everyone. Mr. San said, Based on our human experience in preventing and treating infectious diseases such as plague, cholera, and SAS, we must control infected persons and eliminate BD carriers. In other words, FK Jiangzhou is an inevitable move? If the interruption continues, there will be chaos. If we block it earlier, the chain of transmission will be further reduced. Jiang Cheng frowned and said directly, Yes, there are already hospital doctors in Jiangzhou who are infected. Once the medical institution breaks down, the consequences will be even more serious. Mr. San said seriously, We'll ask for instructions right now. The vice dean glanced at everyone and then left. Zhao Yang's expression was very serious. Jiangzhou has been instructed to install thermometers on high-speed trains and stations. The actual number of infected people in Jiangzhou may be even higher, and people are already panicking. Now that gene sequencing has been released, I suggest that everyone should not be idle and start developing reagents immediately, Jiang Cheng suggested. For now, the goal is to study the virus as quickly as possible, isolate the infected people, and then cure it. Okay, let's move. Time seems to pass very slowly. Jiang Cheng didn't sleep all night and was already a little tired, so he lay back on the chair for a while. Others are not what he is good at. Although he is resting now, he allows the artificial intelligence Xiaofeng in his body to continue taking the biochip to sequence the virus and tries to mobilize immune cells in the body to eliminate the virus in the form of guard proteins. But with little success, by the afternoon, the top management had decided to seal off Jiangzhou and relevant orders were quickly issued. Strong organizational execution capabilities are reflected in China. With one instruction, all departments from top to bottom started taking action. Immediately mobilize people to support the surrounding areas. As for other places, due to F's timely response, the outflow was not particularly large. After an in-depth study of BD, the Ministry of Health issued corresponding measures. Jiang Cheng then asked Fanghua Group Company to donate 100 million yuan in various materials, 
and asked Duolong Industrial to donate to Jiangzhou and send them to Jiangzhou overnight. Major companies have also launched donation actions. In Jiangzhou, the situation slowly began to improve. January 24th is New Year's Eve. Jiang Chang, Chen Jiqiang, and other scientific researchers stayed in Kyoto to conduct research on BD. On this day, D beads were successfully isolated, and reagents were developed using reverse transcription polymerase chain reaction mode based on gene sequencing. Relevant state owned medical device companies took the lead in organizing personnel to conduct trial production. At that time, improvements or expansion of production will be made based on the detection success rate and actual conditions. But for now, the key is to complete the JC with nearly 10 million people in Jiangzhou. Comrades, thanks to the joint efforts of experts and scientific researchers, we have a certain understanding of BD, but we still only have a preliminary understanding of the source of BD, how to prevent and treat it, the symptoms after GR, and the infection sex and all that requires us to keep working on it. Today is New Year's Eve. According to our Chinese tradition, everyone should be reunited at home but the situation is special. Thank you for your hard work. Here's wishing everyone a happy new year. The highest level meeting, in addition to senior personnel, is represented by these experts. Jiang Qingdu can feel that the problem is still serious and complex. Even the Xiao Feng in the body tried every means to study it, but could not find a solution for a while. Because after BD enters the human body, due to its strong YP property, it can integrate with certain cells in the body, making biochip detection difficult. Originally, according to Jiang Cheng's plan, after analyzing the gene sequence, he could give early warning to normal cells and immune cells in the body according to the characteristics of the guardian protein. But the situation was not as good as he imagined. Due to the complexity of BD, 100% detection cannot be achieved, and immune cells are not cold to BD during the incubation period. Even if Jiang Cheng gave an early warning through neural interaction, it's a difficult problem. Academician Jiang, do you have time to chat? After the meeting, when Jiang Cheng was about to return to the institute, a woman in military uniform stopped him. Academician Chun. Jiang Cheng was a little surprised, but he still agreed. The two of them walked and talked. I am very interested in Academician Zhang's biochip. I wonder if I can ask for advice. If you can't bear to ask for advice, let's communicate with each other. Jiang Cheng smiled slightly. I heard that you have very powerful genetic sequencing equipment. Judging from the current research results, the speed is pretty good. In two days, I will lead a team to Jiangzhou. At that time, more BD specimens will be studied in order to study YM. I wonder if academician Jiang can help with sequencing? It is obligatory. Jiang Cheng nodded in agreement. At this time, let's resolve BD together first. As for other things, don't worry too much. Academician Chun stretched out his hand and said, Thank you. This is my research on multiple samples sent to Kyoto. Maybe you can use it. After shaking hands with her, Jiang Chung took out a USB flash drive from his pocket and handed it to her. Okay. Academician Chun nodded. I hope to go there soon. In the evening, Yushin Ron made a video call from Fanghua. The first person to poke his head out was Jiang Xinwan. She looked very beautiful in a princess dress. Dad, when will you come back? Zhang Cheng's smile surged onto his cheeks. Hey, Wan Wan, you look so beautifully dressed today. Grandma bought it for me, doesn't it look good? You look good, like a little princess. Have you received the gift Dad prepared for you? I got it, I haven't put it on yet. Let Mom teach you. Zhang Cheng said with a smile. He customized a small gemstone necklace for Zhang Xinwan which contained a carbon-based chip that could communicate with the mutated biological cells in her body and monitor life and health information. In case of emergency, Jiang Chang can receive information. Now he had to consider Jiang Xinwan's study after the new year. After the new year, Jiang Xinwan will be four years old, and the things he can learn will increase rapidly. If he continues to go to kindergarten or elementary school with ordinary people, it will be a waste of life. Jiang Cheng planned to let Jiang Xinwan complete all kinds of primary school and junior high school courses before she was 7 years old, and take the college entrance examination when she was 10 years old. Then let her choose the major or field she wants to study. As long as she is interested, she can learn everything. It just feels like she's a little younger. 
Therefore, in addition to normal course studies, Yushinran also fully allowed her to develop various interests and hobbies. Chinese studies, writing, practicing piano, and painting were the prescribed actions given to her by Jiang Qing. As for the others, she was allowed to choose freely. Yushinran said that her favorites are mathematics and physics. It seems that a great mathematician and physicist are about to emerge. Jiang Cheng even felt that after waiting for about 10 years, Jiang Xinwan would be able to do scientific research experiments with him. By then, the whole family will be top masters, and it will be a good story to explore higher tech fields together. Chengzi, when will you come back? Chen Ru couldn't help but asked from the side. Under the wide angle lens, you can see her trying to get closer to the camera. Jiang Qingdao said, It should take a few days. I'm studying it with experts right now. If everything goes well, I'll be back soon. Have you had New Year's Eve dinner? Eat. I arranged the dumplings. Chen Ru sighed and said, You are not a doctor or expert. Why are you participating? Now, there are not many people here during the new year. Yu Xinran helped explain, Jiang Cheng is an academician. That's true. Although Chen Ru didn't know the meaning of academician status, she also knew that he was very awesome, even better than doctors and postdocs. Like Jiang Cheng, although he doesn't do much, he still enjoys an academician's allowance, which is about 10,000 yuan per month. Of course, to him, it means nothing. Xinran, where is Xiaoyi? He's sleeping in the room. Yu Xinran said, This kid is much more noisy than Wan Wan when he was a child. Under the camera, Yu Xinran was wearing pajamas. Although she had given birth to two children, she still maintained a good figure. She was smiling now and said, I know you have worked hard, but you have to come back early. Will do. Jiang Cheng nodded heavily. With his joining, research progress accelerated a lot. Nucleic acid reagents are quickly introduced for use. As the Chinese New Year approaches, the hospital is moving forward rapidly. A large number of military doctors, including academician Chan, entered Jiangzhou, and support personnel from major provinces and cities arrived one after another. Love supplies, vegetables, meat, Rice and other items were quickly transported to Jiangzhou. A concerted battle has begun. Jiangzhou, come on. Jiangzhou Huagua, the terrifying demon appears from here. We would like to help in any way we can and pray for them. Yes, I will do that. It is recommended to close. Close the ports quickly and cut off all contact with foreign countries. What? You are. Very good. Shoot him. On the occasion of the Chinese New Year, this moment is not limited to the country. But after Huaguar announced it, many people felt that it had already existed before that. However, none of this news ever spread. The responses from various countries are also different. Some support supplies, some are sarcastic, and some are praying for help. Xinran, is Chengzi back? On the third day of the Lunar New Year, Jiang Yi made a video call to her daughter. Due to unexpected reasons, Yu Xinran and her party did not return to Guanglin County, which made her miss her very much. After learning that Jiang Cheng went to Kyoto to study together, he became even more worried. This is not something without danger. Mom, I'm back. Jiang Cheng was nearby and came over to say hello. Jiang Yi breathed a sigh of relief. That's good. Shui has gone to the headquarters office and no one has come back these days. I heard that no one in the hospital can go home. Don't worry, mom. It's not that scary. Trust us, and trust us researchers. Jiang Qing knew that at this time, everyone was in panic. Yu Xinran nodded and said, Yes, mom. You stay at home and pay attention to safety. Okay. Jiang Yi waved her hand and said irritably, Only your dad and the medical staff can guarantee it. Jiang Qing thought for a while. I will donate a batch of supplies to the county immediately. That's good. It's okay. Jiang Cheng waved his hand. Then, Yu Xinran chatted with her for a while before hanging up the phone. Yu Xinran gently took Jiang Cheng's hand. Jiang Cheng, do you think it will be serious this time? Grandma is getting older. I'm really scared. Believe us, everything will return to normal. Jiang Cheng sat on the edge of the bed and said softly, Yeah. Yu Xinran leaned on his shoulder. It's just that you just gave birth to a baby, so I can't stay with you much longer. It's okay. Wanwan is here, Dad and Mom are here, Lin Yun is here, and Alien is too. 
There are many people at home every day. It's very lively, and I won't be alone. Yushinran said with a smile on her face. Jiang Qing nodded and gently stroked her hair and cheek. Do you still remember your original dream? You said you want everything you learn to be successful and everything you do to be successful. You want society to make more progress and no one in China can bully you. You want to achieve great things in this life and your achievements will be praised for eternity. Yu Xinran stood up from his shoulder and looked at the resolute, gentle and handsome Jiang Cheng in front of her. Her eyes blurred. Now, you have to do it. Four years of bachelor's degree, master's degree, and PhD, two top science and technology awards, the youngest academician and owner of the huge Maple Fire Group. He has become the richest man in China. Everything I really wanted to do was done. In the field of science and technology, it took the lead in the development of DUV and EUV lithography machines, and also develop resistive storage, carbon-based chips, biochip neurons, etc. Be famous. Everyone in the country of China knows it. Everyone knows it. It can be said that with the two words Jiang Cheng, he can bet 100,000 tails of gold. Jiang Cheng hugged her and kissed her earlobe. It's so nice to have you all the way. Seeing each other after a long absence is as lingering and sad as the first rain during a drought. Jiang Zhou, Chun Jinquan relied on the 5 million yuan given by Jiang Cheng to pay off his debts and used the remaining money to join a hot pot restaurant. However, he did not expect that a sudden situation would cause his business to disappear. Originally, winter and the end of the year were the hot seasons. After that, it was closed immediately and all the waiters dispersed. Hey, what the hell is this? It's really annoying. It suddenly appeared here. Zhang Yin said depressedly. Chun Jinquan sighed. Let's protect ourselves. I heard it's quite scary. So scary? Zhang Yin was startled unexpectedly. Then I'll call Lingling back quickly. She's such a girl. And she said she was going to help. And she's risking her life? Chun Jinquan stopped her. What are you calling? Haven't you seen that Lingling has changed a lot in the past two years? Big, why not big? He's so big that he doesn't even tell his mother what's on his mind. Zhang Yin said depressedly. After she agreed to exchange Chen Ling's five years of teaching experience for money, Chen Ling ignored her. Sometimes I talk more to Chen Jinquan, but overall there are very few. During the teaching period, I might only make one phone call a month. Chen Jinquan sighed. Ling Ling has grown up and has her own ideas, so don't worry about her. But aren't you awesome? She will take care to protect you again, but you? Chun Jin Quan rolled his eyes at her. Okay, okay, I'll do whatever you want. Zhang Yin said irritably. Since the factory collapsed, the family's life has become much more difficult, and Jiang Yin has become much more honest. Even the fat on his body has lost a few pounds. Next year, it will almost be time to pay back the money to Jiang Cheng. Originally, according to the situation of the hot pot restaurant, they would be able to earn enough to repay their principal next year. But this time the situation makes them feel even more difficult. However, there are many people who have hard times, and they are far from the only ones. Even Yang Zichin was having a hard time. He believed Jack Owen, a fake China expert, and actually spent 10,000 yuan to rent a fake girlfriend to take home. His home is also in Jiangzhou. And the difference is that his mother accidentally did it. At this time, the entire family was stunned, including the girlfriend she just rented, Shan Shui Yao, a freelancer. It is said that after graduating from college, he wrote novels at home. Later she wanted to write a story about renting a girlfriend, but she had never experienced it, so she gave it a try. Well, he is a very magical screenwriter after all. Xiao Zi, hey, it's me again, don't you accept it? Come and beat me. After following Yang Zichin to Jiangzhou, before he could stay for a day, Yang Zichian's mother came. But there is no doubt that people cannot leave. Yang Zichian sprayed water everywhere in the house very carefully, but he didn't have too much worry. Department a while ago and was laughed at by them, Bing Xiaoqing said. Oh, let's just say that we people, who understand but don't understand, work behind closed doors, and the circuit designed by software for one component is different from what they designed. Bing Xiaoqing said with shame. Zhang Qing nodded, carbon-based chips are a new thing, and it's normal for everyone to not understand them. This spring, 
we will recruit some graduate students or doctoral students in Shuemu to study carbon-based chips. In addition, if you really want to come and study, I will compile the lecture notes for you. Jiang Chung continued, If you have time, I will come to teach you in the evening. Employees of your own company also need to improve their business capabilities. Although graduates are good, they are still not as good as these veteran employees in terms of business familiarity. Do not favor one over another. That's great. Bing Xiaoqing said happily, Have you bought a house in Pingqing? I bought it and started a family. Bing Xiaoqing scratched his bald head and said, Oh, why didn't you tell me when? Jiang Chang was a little surprised. At the end of last year, because of this unexpected incident, I didn't even serve a drink, so I got the certificate directly. Bing Xiaoqing explained, It's a girl from my hometown who works in a company here in Pingqing. Congratulations then. Zhang Cheng said with a smile. Over the past few years, time has made everyone grow older. This group of partners who joined Zhang Cheng during his entrepreneurial period gradually have their own families. I also have two children, and they are already perfect. In emotion, Zhang Cheng stayed for a while before leaving. Yu Xinran plans to go back to work. She was bored at home alone. Now that her home was here, not far from the company, she decided to come back to work. With the powerful memory she also possesses, she can face all kinds of problems with ease. Therefore, I don't want to be a complete housewife. What's more, Jiang Chung also gave her some division of labor arrangements on the board of directors. There is no need to worry about finance, but the focus becomes supervision and audit work. This also wants her to pay attention to the financial situation of the group company and each subsidiary. Because the company's current annual revenue is in the billions or tens of billions, and the group's head office, Maple Fire Technology, and semiconductor companies are in the hundreds of billions. The huge amount of funds also means an increase in the scope for corruption. Letting her take charge of this matter is also a sign of Jiang Cheng's trust in her. Jiang Cheng welcomed this. While Jiang Cheng was busy with the company, China was safe, but this ghost was wreaking havoc all over the world. These free countries abroad were mocking China just now, but now they are suddenly infected, especially in the Asian Kingdom. It is said that the people who died did not even have the wood to burn. The United States did not hesitate to give in. The number of infections soon surpassed that of China, and it was far ahead. Many American billionaires are confused. Doesn't this thing only infect Chinese people? Why is everyone infected? Oh God, come and bless. We suspect that this thing was leaked from China, and we request to come to Jiangzhou, China, for investigation. Many American politicians said publicly on the internet and on television. As for the matter of their own national responsibilities, they were all silent. People died. I'm sorry, that's normal. I don't know if it's because of this thing. They are poor people and they can't afford medical treatment, right? What surprised him was that there was not a single case of medical breakdown in the United States. It's just that some unlucky people died. God is calling them. They lost their lives, but they gained their freedom. Resolutely opposed the so-called theory of the origin of China's Jiangzhou by the United States. At a regular press conference in China, Zhao Jini spoke sternly. We welcome the WHO to participate in the traceability investigation with us. If you want to come to China to investigate, I think we should go to the United States to investigate. Prior to this, news had spread on the internet that the genetic B virus had been leaked from a biological research base in the United States because the B virus had been detected in people who had died of influenza in the United States. The internet and international quarrels have caused chaos, but they have not affected China's normal resumption of work and production. Under the advice of experts such as Zhong Shan and Jiang Cheng, we will promote protective proteins on a large scale and at the same time speed up vaccine experiments and strive to complete clinical trials as early as possible to facilitate normal vaccination. However, what is somewhat ironic is that because China acted quickly, there are now no cases in the country. If you want to conduct experiments, you can only conduct them abroad. In addition, it is to strengthen immigration control, especially to prevent illegal immigrants from Southeast Asia and other countries. As long as this bottom line is maintained, there is no way for some tiny viruses to infect Chinese people who have already consumed protective proteins again. But this also puts great pressure on China. Because as China resumes work, its huge production capacity begins to skyrocket. 
in foreign countries due to the spread of the disease, chaos has begun. And some countries even have zero-dollar purchases. A large number of products are shipped from China to all over the world. The ocean shipping company and medical equipment company invested by Jack Owen made a lot of money this time. This was his first time investing on his own, and he didn't expect to make a lot of money. When he talked about this matter with Yang Zichian, the other party calmly replied, Is this what I suggested? He he, yes, Yang, you are still the best. Yang Zichian was a little irritated. I was kind enough to teach you, but you were kind enough to teach me to rent a girlfriend for the Chinese New Year, and you made me miserable? Uh-huh. What's going on? Forget it. I'm too lazy to tell you. Yang Zichian hung up the phone directly. After finishing speaking, he looked at Shun Shui Yao who was in the same room as Ji. The two of them originally thought of going their separate ways after leaving Zhangzhou, but they didn't expect that they would be arrested and separated as soon as they returned to Jinling. This hotel also puts two people in one room. Reason. The two are lovers. The practical reason is that there are not enough hotels. Suddenly, a large number of people in Jiangzhou moved. Although it was said that it was liberated, people in various places were still worried and would rather stay away from them for a few more days, just in case. This time, the two lived together again. When they were at home in Jiangzhou, the two of them lived in the same room just to be more real. But in fact, Shan Shui Yao slept on the bed and he slept on the folding chair. But this time, it is a double bedroom. This gave him a headache, so he became very indifferent to Irving's call. It was what he said about renting a girlfriend that made him believe in evil and caused so many things. Hey, have you read my novel? Shin Shui Yao didn't pay much attention to it and went directly to bed to type while asking. Yang Zichian took the time to read it and found it a bit strange, especially the part about the domineering president. The description in it was based on him as a template. It's just that he didn't know that the CEO inside was so weird that he would pursue her like that. Be funny. Well, the writing is unrealistic. Yang Zichian thought for a while and commented directly. Shin Shui Yao chuckled and said, That's for sure. This is a novel. It's written for readers. As long as they enjoy reading it, it doesn't matter whether it's true or not. Besides, I have never met the president of the company, so how can I know what he is like? Then you still write like you have a nose and eyes. They are all from Chindu. I also asked my best friend whether she works in a company or at Funghua Company. Shin Shui Yao said with a smile. Yang Zichin frowned. Maple Fire Company? Yes, he just joined the company last year, in Feng Huayun's company. Shin Shui Yao said. Cloud and big data companies. Yes, you should remember, there are too many Funghua companies. I can't remember them all. Shin Shui Yao said. Yang Zichin said with a cold face. Why? Did she say their boss is overbearing? That's not true. Shin Shui Yao shook her head. But she told me what departments the company usually has and what positions it has, and I knew how to make it up. As for novels, I just make up stories for readers. I'm going to take a shower. Yang Zichin didn't want to talk about this anymore, because what Shin Shui Yao wrote later had already begun to spread so much that Yang Zichin couldn't stand it anymore. I really don't understand why girls write those things and seem to have a clear understanding of boy psychology. Afterwards, Yang Zichian went directly to bed and occupied one side. Let's make an agreement first, let's sleep on each side and don't cross the line. Shin Shui Yao put down his notebook, rested his face on his hands, and looked at him with a smile. Hey, I was thinking, since you are so handsome, is it okay? What did you say? Yang Zichian immediately became furious, sat up and stared at her. Shin Shui Yao was startled and waved her hands hurriedly. I, I'm just asking. I'm going to take a shower. Yang Zichian waved his hand and fell asleep again. Out of sight, the mind is pure. But the sound of dripping water in the bathroom made him upset. Especially when I read Shan Shui Yao's novel later, I felt myself inexplicably involved in it. Is falling in love sweet? Is that really how she wrote the book? Yang Zichian has been very strictly controlled by his parents since he was a child. In addition to studying, there are strict rules on how to behave and do things. He has strict rules on daily meals, work, and rest. It is said that it was scientifically developed by two PhD parents. This also led to the fact that Yang Zichian had never been in love, and he had never even watched a movie before college. But now, for a moment, 
I felt confused. After a while, Shun Shui Yao came out, with wet hair and a delicate fragrance. The sound of the hair dryer started to sound. Yang Zichin was helpless, turned on his Fanghua Q6 phone, and couldn't help but read two more chapters of Shun Shui Yao's novel. Looking at it, I unconsciously showed my aunt's smile. Suddenly I felt someone coming over. Hey, let's see what novel you are reading again. Look at yours. Yang Zichian said truthfully. Hee hee, how did these two chapters go? Feed the dog food. I have a lot of inspiration these days, and I feel good. Maybe I quarrel with you too much? Xin Shui Yao said with a smile. It's a pity that you don't look like the CEO at all. Otherwise, I would just follow what you wrote and save me the trouble of thinking up ideas. Yang Zichian felt that the other person was sitting next to him. When he looked up, he could see the mountains rising and falling, and the fragrance was fragrant, and his heart suddenly jumped. You go over there. Xin Shui Yao then stood up and said, Continue reading and give me a five star review later. Um. Yang Zichian took a breath and felt that he couldn't go on like this. Xin Shui Yao still wanted to code. So she put on her pajamas and lay on the bed to code. Yang Zichian felt like he was suffocating. Over the years, my virgin mind had become so messed up that I had no choice but to close my eyes and recite the Heart Sutra silently, and then I fell asleep first. But unexpectedly, in my sleep, I only felt a big stove next to me, roasting myself until I wanted to add cumin. Then he suddenly woke up and saw that Xin Shui Yao, who was lying next to him, was hot all over, but seemed to be cold, and he was squeezed all the way to his side. Reach out and touch it. So hot. Halo, do you have a fever at this time? Yang Zichin was startled unexpectedly, and hurriedly went to get a towel and put it on her forehead, but after a while, the towel became hot. He washed the towel again and wiped the sides of his cheeks. At this moment, Shun Shui Yao was already talking in his sleep, and he couldn't hear clearly what was being said. While holding the thermometer gun that I carried, a red alarm sounded. Damn, 40 degrees 3? Yang Zichin didn't dare to delay and quickly called the doctor. Because it was G divorce, I was not sent to the hospital, but I was given an intravenous drip directly at the hotel. Sitting on the chair, Yang Zichin looked at the girl in front of him. The eyelashes are long, the face is a little baby fat, the cheeks are red and hot due to the fever, and the lips are a little white. He was busy all night boiling and pouring water. As daybreak approached, the temperature dropped. At this time, Yang Zichin was so tired that he fell asleep leaning on the chair. At this moment, he no longer cared about elegance. His head hung on the edge of the chair, and he fell asleep with his mouth open. By April, the entire country of China had been cleared and returned to normal. However, foreign pornography comes one after another, and it seems that it will never stop. China's top officials have strengthened entry control in accordance with expert advice. In particular, after Carlin Biotech developed the protective protein, it shared the virus characteristics with the expert group, and the expert group optimized the detection reagent based on this. This prevents viruses that are still in the incubation period from escaping detection, which greatly improves the effectiveness of prevention and control. The original seven day quarantine was shortened to three days. Moreover, starting in April, medical insurance will coordinate the purchase of the Guanshan Biochip Protective Protein, which will be fully rolled out and available to people for free. The estimated requirement is 1.4 billion doses. The large-scale demand has also brought the price down to 20 yuan per dose, but this is also a profit of 28 billion yuan. Carlin Biotechnology has become the most famous biotechnology company in China in one fell swoop. Some people estimate that Carlin Biotech's revenue in 2020 will exceed 50 billion. The average price of Bayes Guardian protein during the promotion period was 10,000 yuan. There are more than 4 million new cancer patients in China every year, and there are even more existing people. Forecasters, just based on 4 million doses, that would be 40 billion yuan in revenue. As general manager, Yang Hui is already flying into the sky to stand shoulder to shoulder with the sun. I am extremely busy every day, with enrollment expansion and authorization. According to Jiang Cheng's requirements, Bayes Guardian protein is not authorized and is produced entirely by itself. The second phase of the Kalen Hangzhou factory is being expanded and is expected to achieve maximum production capacity in 2021. 
The annual output of Bayes Guardian protein is 6 million servings. As for the protective proteins used to treat diseases, Carlin Biotech has no energy and production capacity because the demand is too high, and 80% of them have been licensed out. It's just that Maple Fire Semiconductor, Hangzhou, is fully committed to producing the carbon nanotubes needed for proteins, and Carlin Biotechnology adds neuromorphic functions and sequence detection programs to these carbon nanotubes and batches. As for the rest, they were distributed to other companies to participate together. The big cake is too big, but it doesn't make much money. Zhang Chung estimates that Carlin Biotech can earn 60% of the 28 billion yuan. For ingredients were given to two major Sinopharm companies. After all the companies were on track, Zhang Chung was doing his job as CEO on a rotating basis, arranging the formation of Maple Fire Aerospace Company and following up on the clinical trial results of Mapletsi Biotechnology Company. So far, what Zhang Lan reports is that the results have been very successful. The first person in the world to have improved memory is Luo Ming. Since the trial last year, he has received scientific memory training and mastered this method of long-term memory improvement and consolidation. To this day, I still have a very strong memory. Some things that have been memorized for a long time have basically formed a solid memory, just like the familiar chapters of the 300 Tang poems, which can be recited casually. According to Zhang Lan, Luo Ming was able to memorize Zizi Tongjian completely with almost no mistakes or omissions. His strong memory also gave him great help in scientific research. Nowadays, Luo Ming is not being studied at all, but continues to join the team for research, becoming a typical representative of extremely rapid improvement in level. However, Zhang Chang did not promote the experiment on a large scale within the team. Although he is very sure, it still takes time to test. Due to time constraints, Jiang Chung passed the test and found that this tube was not permanent. It was expected that he would need to take another tube of medicine in about one and a half to two years. Jiang Chung actually had ways to improve it, but after thinking about it for a long time, there was still no improvement. The reason is that, through this method, society can slowly accept this medicine, instead of suddenly everyone improving their memory. Not only that, he also felt that it would be unfair to have a strong and permanent memory based solely on carbon-based chips, because some people work hard, and some people don't work hard. The current situation is an excellent phenomenon. This allows Jiang Chung to fully roll out the medicine every three years or so. The estimated number of times each person can take it is five to ten times. Taking it again by then will have no effect, and through these times, relatively long-term memory storage can basically be achieved. Of course, when people get older, their functions will naturally weaken and they will not be able to maintain strong memories for a long time. This is also normal. At the same time, Jiang Chang is still somewhat selfish. We don't want technology to develop too fast. Kyoto, China Convention Center. Jiang Chang, Professor Zhang Lan, the experimenter Luo Ming and other researchers came here, waiting for discussions with several leaders. Since the early trials were very effective, Hua also wanted to take this opportunity to promote a batch of them first. The main target groups are students who are about to take the college entrance examination, as well as undergraduate and graduate students. The focus is on scientific researchers. The first batch of 5,000 people was selected. It's just that Jiang Chang didn't expect that China would come to hold a centralized meeting. The first batch of personnel will be put into intensive use soon. This can be regarded as an experiment. The leaders will pay close attention to it. This group of subjects will be trained here for 15 days, which can be regarded as testing the effect. The leader is still the Deputy Minister of Health Zhao Yang. There were also a group of people, including the Deputy Minister of Education. Although Jiang Chang has already conducted several clinical trials in Jincheng, some leaders still have doubts. Later, we simply added up and selected 5,000 people to come here for training. At that time, they would be intensively injected with the Maple Wisdom Memory Potion. During the training process, the effects would be slowly tested. If this is indeed feasible, then sales will be opened as planned. It can be said that the relevant leaders of China are still relatively cautious. Jiang Qing nodded. That's fine. I can also guide them on how to train to maximize the effectiveness of Feng Ji's memory. Well, that's perfect. You good boy. It's not good to position this as a healthcare product. Zhao Yang glanced at Jiang Cheng and criticized, 
I heard the little calculations you made in Western Sichuan in Kyoto. This can be considered as such. Jiang Cheng smiled. Currently, our understanding of this kind of combination of chips and biological cells is limited, and we really don't know how to supervise and manage it. But it is too much to consider it as a health product. Jiang Cheng explained. This thing is something that helps neurons' memory. It has the same effect as the active ingredients of other health products. If it falls off or is damaged, the protein will carry these things and excrete them. In short, we still have some doubts. Of course, we are not sticklers. As long as it is effective, we are willing to support promotion, but we must also monitor the risks involved. Clear. Okay, it's almost time. Let's go to the venue. Zhang Cheng walked in front, followed closely by Zhang Lan. Luo Ming and several other researchers went to sit under the stage. At a glance, they are all young people. On the list, among the 5,000 people, there are 1,000 high school sophomores who are about to become seniors. They are all students from Huagua Middle School. During the selection, opinions were solicited from both sides. Since Zhang Fengji memory was tested in Jincheng, some very effective news broke out on the internet, and the official media even promoted it once, which made many people not very reluctant to this health medicine. On the contrary, I am very proud to be selected and come to the Huagua Convention Center for a 15-day training. Another 1,000 undergraduates, 1,000 graduate students, and 500 doctoral students. The last 1,500 are researchers from relevant research institutions in China. Most of these people were surprised when they saw the handsome and young academician Jiang Cheng walk to the rostrum and take a seat. That's Jiang Cheng. I heard that he researched Feng Ji's memory. No wonder the results are so good. We are the lucky ones to have been chosen. As long as I have strong memory ability, I can become Jiang Cheng's second in scientific research in the future. Considering the confidentiality and safety of the medicine, Jiang Cheng improved the Feng Ji memory medicine so that it can only be injected through a special injection. Not only that, after everyone uses it, there will be a corresponding number, which is matched with the personal ID number, corresponding to each other one by one, eliminating the possibility of medicine leaking out. In order to do these protective measures, some costs were spent, and of course they were all included in the selling price of the medicine. The improved medicine cannot be taken orally, but requires a special syringe, which is injected by a doctor and followed by a three-day safety observation. It should be said that it is a very rare opportunity for you to be selected to participate in this training, and it also reflects the great importance that the country attaches to your future development. As you may know, Fungji memory is currently very popular on the internet. In Jinxing, people who have undergone the experiment have become geniuses with amazing memories. Today, the country has chosen you to give you a chance to become a genius. This opportunity can be said to be extremely precious and makes others extremely envious. The price of one dose of Fungji memory is 19,999 yuan. You don't have to pay for it today because the state pays for it for you. I hope that in the coming time, everyone will follow the training memory method to fully activate the potential of Fungji memory. Zhao Yang glanced at Jiang Cheng beside him and said with a smile, Everyone is also very lucky. Academician Jiang Cheng will be here with you for 15 days for your growth and will also give you some lessons. This was also considering the need for training, so Jiang Cheng agreed. In addition, these first batch of targets can also be said to be the first batch of large-scale users of Jiang Cheng's new drug, and they should be paid more attention to. After the gathering, the Fungji memory, Potions were injected one by one. Twenty professional doctors and nurses bound the personnel information and drug information one by one, and then completed the injection of the drug. After being observed for half an hour, there were no adverse reactions. However, the effect did not appear quickly, so Zhao Yang asked everyone to return to the room to rest. Early tomorrow morning, Jiang Chang will personally instruct Feng Ji on the memory method. A large group of people were preparing to leave. Jiang Qing also took a look and saw some familiar people. All the 18 special class students he brought under his guidance were inside. When Yao Shuanyu was about to leave, he even came over to say hello. In addition, Hao Yongjun, Zhu Jian, and Zhang Ming are also among them. They are all generals ordered by Jiang Cheng himself. I just guessed it was you. Hao Yongjun said with a heavy nasal voice. Zhang Ming smiled and said, That's for sure. 
If you're not a master, how could all of us be chosen? Zhu Jin, on the other hand, was a little confused. When the hospital first contacted me, I was confused. It turns out you were the one who added us. That is, this memory improvement will be of great help to your future research or work. Zhang Cheng said. Hee hee, one day we can compare our memory ability with third brother. Zhu Jin suddenly felt that he was very strong and felt a little proud. You're thinking too much. Zhang Cheng said angrily. That's right. Master is the most powerful. Zhang Ming said with admiration. Zhang Cheng waved his hand. Okay, you guys go back and have a rest. It should take effect slowly in the evening and be completely absorbed within three days. If you want to truly achieve photographic memory, you need to learn training methods from me. Okay, let's talk later. How Yong Jun pulled Zhu Jian, knowing that Jiang Chang had a lot to do, so he said no more and left. Are these your doctoral students? Zhao Yang came over and asked. Yes, if everything goes well, I can graduate this year. Jiang Chang said, however, my requirements are relatively high. Imagine that in the near future, our country will have a large number of scientific researchers like you, and the level of science and technology will definitely improve rapidly, said the Ministry of Education official next to Zhao Yang. That's natural. Seeing how young they are, I'm very envious. Academician Zhang, can this medicine really be remembered after taking this medicine? Zhao Yang then asked. Short-term memory is very strong, but it is not that easy to achieve long-term memory consolidation. Jiang Cheng raised his lips slightly. Can we use it too? Of course. Jiang Cheng Dao. But the current production is limited, and an online lottery will be required. There are only one million doses a year. Several people around him secretly expressed regret. However, since we are so old, we still need a photographic memory. It would be nice if we could use it for our grandchildren. Yes. At this moment, everyone looked at Jiang Cheng with burning eyes. It's just that Jiang Chang is indifferent to this. It is expected that on May 1st, Mapletsi Memory Potion will open for reservations on the Maple Fire Group's official website. You can make reservations in time, and numbers will be drawn regularly. Well, everyone was a little helpless. It can be said that Jiang Ching's method made many people unhappy, but there was no way. Not only in China, but also in the whole world. Only Jiang Ching's family had this magical potion. In addition, 5,000 quotas are given to the country every year, and you can choose from them. Jiang Cheng reminded, This so-called free quota is paid for by the state, but the personnel are proposed by senior officials. When they have to solve some problems of their own children and grandchildren, they can also do so from this aspect. I just don't know if production capacity will be increased in the future. Will it be released? Yes, it is estimated that it will be fully liberalized in five or six years. Jiang Cheng smiled slightly, don't worry, everyone, but we can think about the fact that a large number of gifted children and gifted students will appear in the future, and our education will also need to change. Vice Minister Liang of the Ministry of Education nodded and said, This leader has already explained that starting from the second half of this year, all middle schools and primary schools will offer preparatory classes. There is no age limit. Anyone who meets the conditions can skip a grade. It is estimated that students can take the college entrance examination as early as 10 years old. As for universities, restrictions on major selection will be relaxed for this type of talent. As long as students are capable enough, they can study multiple majors at the same time. Bachelors, masters, and doctoral degrees can be studied consecutively, and they can be completed in a minimum of five years. When Vice Minister Liang talked about it, he felt incredible. But the reality is this. With the promotion of Fungji Memory Potion, a large number of genius-level people will definitely emerge. By then, ordinary education will limit their development. However, I think we need to strengthen ideological and moral education and patriotic education so that all these talents don't go abroad. Zhao Yang said, Definitely. For those who stay abroad to serve, our company will set up a blacklist in the future and they will not be able to continue to inject subsequent doses. By then, their photographic memory will slowly disappear. Zhao Yang thought to himself, this move is really cruel. This also puts Maple Fire Group in an invincible position, right? In dialogue, Tong Lao used the talisman of life and death to control others, and it is similar today. 
Zhang Cheng indirectly controls everyone through Fangji memory. Who can accept that the photographic memory will disappear if the next injection is not given in a few years? If Jiang Cheng had not formed an alliance of interest with the country to jointly produce and apply it, he would have been assassinated. It has cut off too many people's financial resources. Even countries like the United States will hate Jiang Cheng to the core. China's science and technology is developing rapidly under the leadership of a large number of geniuses, but they will fall behind in both chips and talents. This is something they cannot bear. Zhao Yang even thought that the United States would not go crazy and start a world war by then, right?